think it's $12,000 and $16,000. I can imagine them going into a R300 and R500 naming rather than sticking with the C300 Mark IV and C500 Mark III. And it's exciting to know what else they might choose to put in there, like 32-bit float audio, high-quality remote video via Wi-Fi. They certainly need to come in above what the existing market has, given how long they've waited uh, to announce these. Global Shutter is also a possibility, though not something I think a lot of people are screaming for, at least in the uh, cinema and documentary market. So if you're in the market for a Canon cinema camera, be it full frame or Super 35, it doesn't look like we'll get an announcement until September and probably not delivery until uh, this time next year. But again, all just rumors, but these ones make a lot of sense to me.